Ça a fait tout le monde, ça a fait euh, bienvenue dans le podcast Corim, c'est avec vos amis pour lutter. Et mes amis, pas oublier, le podcast est disponible de tous côtés. Allez sur Apple Podcast, allez sur YouTube et allez sur Spotify ou abonnez le podcast. Ça, et pas oublier tout et quittez un review pour nous et bah, nous feedback ou, afin que vous soyez capable d'améliorer ça. Je Jeudi à nous, un invité spécial et invité ça, Lee, c'est founder de. Golden, a founder and president of Golden V, and qui a fait un bel travail dans la communauté à KPD et jeunes haïtiens uh, haïtiennes, et spécialement qui sont en high school, qui voulaient entrer dans le collège et côté que um, organisation a fait toutes les ressources jeunes qui ont supposé gagner pour entrer dans le collège. Et c'est avec un peu de plaisir, je dis à pour gagner avec nous. Et Anit Benjamin et sous podcast Corim. Anit, bienvenue dans le podcast Corim. Ok, merci. Um, avant de commencer l'interview, je voulais dire tout le monde, je fais Haïti, je suis déjà là à 5 ans. Donc, je ne suis pas à bon, je suis déjà là à faire l'interview en anglais, ok? Pas de problème, pas de problème, pas de problème. Je ne vais pas parler de ça avec plusieurs fois. Oui, je dois vous dire que je suis I, I like that you're doing this, you know, making us, you know, um, put me by the clear in the interview. I really, really love it. So it's forcing me to, you know, to clear the uh, uh, Vini, but, you know, I had to let you guys know so people don't make fun of me, you know? No, if I can't go blah, blah, blah. But it's a new thing that we want to do at the end of the podcast. Because we want to create a bridge. Avec les Haïtiens right. qui font les sites, avec les Haïtiens qui soutiennent Haïti. Ou après, les mm-hmm. Haïtiens qui soutiennent Haïti, yo, eh, yo, yo, des fois, ils ne peuvent pas parler anglais. Mais les Haïtiens qui font les sites, des fois, ils ne peuvent pas parler créole. Donc, so, um, c'est bah, si, bah, si important et pour nous, uh, on both sides, right, donc, right. pour nous faire des efforts pour nous parler. Mais nous n'avons pas une interview en anglais. En anglais, ok. Merci, merci, merci. <laughs> ok. <laughs> Aye, Adi. Avant de même commencer et parler peu plus de qui est suivi et qui s'en fait. Okay, so my name is Anise Benjamin. Um, this is I think this is um Castle Porter Prince. Um, I'm so to Lago Nav. So I'm going to be in um in Florida. Um, I'm living with my mom. Um, I'm going to allow it to have a on pan ki on single parent. You have to do like everything by yourself. So, mm-hmm. lent in the high school, and I'm okay for, um, I became put to, you know, bad guy fast for college applications to bad guy style. Um, I'm the applicant for no HBCU, so I entered in Florida A&M University, mm-hmm. the best HBCU in the world, by the way. If you guys didn't <laughs> know, I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you heard that. Okay. <laughs> Yo <laughs> All right, so um, let me put put um Tallahassee. My mom, my mom had um had a couple of Ashton rental. Um, we had new we had a couple new Ashton um comforters, uh fridge, two bag of So I'm just trying to ride as like on some cousin one, my Tallahassee. But yeah, let me let let me say two bag of sayo, but. By what I am, just okay, you know, I'm going to school, whatever. So, I'm attend um, Florida A&M University. Gradu- I graduated December 9, 2016, with my bachelor's in interdisciplinary studies. Mm-hmm. And um, I was the president of the Haitian Culture Club, I was the president of the United Haitian Students of Florida, and I'm the student court, I was the student coordinator for the NWHP um, conference wow. for 2018 nice. 2019. Yeah. Um, so, those are a few things that I did. So, I'm the, to um, in the Haitian community working, um, providing resources, and to do access that, anyways. Um, right now, I am um, a student at Bear University getting my master's in public administration. Um, Dava Avic Early Learning Coalition of Palm Beach County, all family service specialists, and provide resources um, for low income stu- um, families 
no early learning coalition in Palm Beach County. So I'm Deja Tabai in the industry nonprofit, I'm Deja Tabai in the public administration, and to Bagai Sayo. So, yeah, that's my introduction. Bomba guy, bomba guy, and it uh, seems like you have your nomad Munyo, you have your hands full. There's a. Oh, yeah, I'm really able to mention my influencer, Tijanguele, your Instagram influencer. Yeah, so I do content creation get on YouTube too. So with that alone, that's a lot. Yeah, <laughs> that's that's like all the career goals and stuff. Yeah, no, that's yeah. that's not that's not easy at all. You know, people see you know um, content creators like posting every day or every other day. You know, they it's think hard. it's easy, but it's not. It's not easy. It's really not. Now that you get to I said no, 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 it's all Et mm-hmm. où créer une organisation qui est le Golden V. Et font ils parler mm-hmm. des organisations ça et qui sont qui sont fait là dedans. Okay, so um, Golden V incorporated an organisation qui aide les um, low income high school students. Um, de commencer l'entreprise um, Golden V est de commencer et de monter dans Palm Beach County. Team de commencer et de um, team dans Palm Beach County. So um they are in the high school when they have a um avec team on the east department na na Palm Beach Lakes High School shout out to the Rams by the way um they call um they it um team on the Palm Beach Lakes High School for your um applicant for college that's mm-hmm. uh and things like that so let me just say come say it from it the team on the Palm Beach so that's how it first started i wasn't thinking about South Florida, I wasn't thinking about Florida, I wasn't thinking about global. That was the team on Kifet Palm Beach because mm-hmm. um a lot of them are they they don't go off to college. So sure. yeah, so they are in the Palm Beach uh Lakes High School more. Um shout out to the Rams by the way, Palm Beach Lakes High School. Then the high school one Pale Avec East the ESO director, and then we say, we will have need to provide college resources and readiness tips to um, palavic team union and things like that. So, echo something come and say, and then after that, we will say, okay, we will have a team union with Bagai Prom League. So, we will have a team prom on TC or whatever. So, then, um, found application nobody applied only one person applied and it was she was from Fort Lauderdale and then this idea it did it in Palm Beach County you know what I'm saying <laughs> mm-hmm. so I'm like okay okay whatever I'm gonna whoever needs help I'm gonna help that kid deny her and be like no I can't help you or whatever so um New Day Film Program Yale um Glass Slippers Prom Project New Day um partner up avec um Haitians Who Blog and Dream Life mm-hmm. and then New Day Put Tu Pagai Prom New Day Pay Pusali Shivil Makeup Lee It's the uh Kisha um the Hills. I, I yeah. just forgot how to say Hills in Korea. It's a Sulier New Papa Pu Sulier but everything else we paid for or whatever. Um and then um I was like, okay let me tell my college um by the against supplies come out of college by the against dorm supplies at home i i had them used in microwaves i didn't have a mini fridge nothing like that something was in the cost out came with it so on golden ticket uh mm-hmm. prom drive so mm-hmm. Monday to community uh, put your donate um by guy pool on on team of um college um or whatever. So I did the application, only one person applied and they were from Fort Lauderdale. I was like, <laughs> I'm trying to help out my Palm Beach people. So you need to open up a I, little bit. <laughs> right? I don't know. So then we try your language so Kunyam because uh Golden V Incorporated we it's this um low income high school students in South Florida. Mm-hmm. So that's what we do. So that's basically Golden V right there. Interesting, interesting. Moi, moi même personnellement, vraiment, vraiment apprécié de l'avoir fait. Je me suis dit, j'ai peu de fois, il avec Pajwa sur uh, IG, and then right away, yeah. text him, dit, yo, you know, keep it up, because I know exactly yeah, what you're doing. Because, yeah, parce que yeah. Bonnie, um, 
je ne sais pas si je suis déjà spécialement moi-même de passer dans l'isol. Je suis venu ici. 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 Je suis But yeah. they are not therefore they're not curious, but they don't have mm. stock organization with mm-hmm. Paula who can mm-hmm. provide them with that. So, mm-hmm. yeah, that's, that's pretty amazing. Um, Thank you. But what is it that you do with organization like that? What inspired you? It was... It was because I went through it. Mm-hmm. So, let okay, I'm going to do Juvelet, um, so create a non-profit organization since I was um, very young. I'm going to do I always had passion to give and help people. So, we're going to, when you're Haitian, I'm going to do a non-profit because, okay, I'm going to open a non-profit in Haiti and I'm about to do team on your IT. Mm-hmm. and buy stuff for them and stuff like that, which is really good or whatever. But I didn't want to do that. You already know Haiti's a, a non-profit world, basically. That's how they get a lot of, you know, their, that's their, their stereotype. That's how they get a lot of, you know, help. Because we're not going to say that's what it is. But that's the stereotype or whatever. It's a whole bunch of non-profits there. But mm-hmm. what about the kids in America? Kids, right. it is Timon Mula, you know? Yes. So I was just like... I want to create a nonprofit here this um team on um I see in La like in hate in America. Mm-hmm. But a lot of um you you really don't start needing assistance for things until you reach high school and grad uh high school and college. Mm-hmm. You know? The new day I program for new um by you know, school supplies for elementary kids. Right. middle schools and things like that. So I was just like, I didn't want to do anything like that. So because I I know I'm going to keep up, I had to go, I, I know what I had to go through mm-hmm. or whatever. I was like, this is perfect. Let me create something. So it started with me and my journey and and basically realizing like, okay, there's a need. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's a need and I went through it. And if I, since they go on organizations like Goals and V, I would have been further, you know? Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. And then I, I talked to my peers and talked about you. You remember that? Like, you know, for example, I'm not going to apply for it fast, but I'm not going to apply for it. I'm not going to apply for W2. Hey, I think we all went through this, man. Yeah. Like, every. Everybody or MMMK applicant for two bag, I'm MMMK fill everything out, and I'm uh, yeah, not but um, I didn't understand anything, you know. So if we all are going through this, what organization is assisting us? What organization is providing resources to us? The um, the Hispanic people have their organization. The Chinese people, I've researched it. They have uh, resources. We mm-hmm. really don't in America, you know. So that's why I decided to. Um, make golden bee. Bon, okay. Interesting. Vraiment, vraiment. Et j'aime tout ça. Vraiment apprécié. Vraiment apprécié. Et travail va faire. Et souhaite au continuer qu'un bel avance. Mais on est pas là pas facile. On connaît. I know it's not easy. Yeah, it's not facile. And um, so, souhaite au souhaite au continuer qu'un bel avance. Que définitivement soit déjà li li important parce que c'est chaque côté qui a un problème, right? So quand plusieurs gens viennent à Haïti, Haïti. But what about So who team in keep boys sit you keep low and come by so exactly. keep again your resources. Um, so uh-huh. um, keep it up. Um, key challenge I guess a pendant who up a manage a organizations are key challenge a who join but not fessa. Okay, I want to firstly say um, the Haitian community you aid them up feel like nice. people I don't know they help me a lot. So thankfully, that's not one of the issues. On uh, issue again, my friend to back up, we can't wear back on team. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So back up, 
yeah, I'm back on team, and it's hard to. I mean, up till I yeah, um, you get a memvision that you know you're related to Timon, um, Haitian students and stuff and things like that. But when you're back in some, you're it did put your join an organization, put your part of the team and things like that. I have an organization that a the vision that I have for it, you have to have put in some time towards it. Mm-hmm. So the biggest struggle is it, my first two guys for family thing. I'm going on board of directors. You're a dem um nice. you That's know. Awesome. With, with yeah they helped me with like decisions big mm-hmm. decisions but executing things i need a team or whatever so i've done applications before you know not nobody applies but it's okay <laughs> <laughs> that's right that's the, that's part of the process <laughs> yeah that's part of the process it's okay so yeah my family body i up my so it's a little bit hard you know if you listen to the podcast too i meant vision of the purpose and super so apply definitely go to golden v inc at gmail.com and then because i'm the applicant from it and you're already in the team no interview i'm just kidding <laughs> 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 so eske taku eske taku si u ta pou fè golden v encore knowing what you know now eske gon ba ou ta fè differently that that Okay, I'm from the Commonwealth, the Commonwealth Palm Beach mm-hmm. County. That that for for the whole South Florida. And then let me come say I didn't understand um teacher who made the sponsorship. Mm-hmm. You have to act mm-hmm. like three months in advance and things like that. So I would have changed my routine of acting for sponsorship. And honestly, I don't have I'm begging regret for process one. Let me some says. So I really changed too much. Um let me say come to go then be that this that established on team. Mm-hmm. Of um of um established golden team that this that president of uh, vice well, I would have been president, but the vice president, you know, that this that on team that probably have it moon of uh mm-hmm. present the vision to them and then after that we start on whole organization me. I started a whole like, oh, organization not knowing it's bigger than my vision, you know? Right, right, right. The whole team. So that's what I would have done different. But I really appreciated the process. So, like yeah. So pretty much I learned all that. I guess the mistake you made or the bad thing you learned. So that's good. Yeah. Um, yeah, so Kunya, ki I guess key goal, key vision, or key goal to have Lee Man and Golden V. Okay. Um, I understand it. It did on on this year with the Christopher. Yeah, he's going to Florida A and M University, by the way. New it did new by on scholarship pool two thousand dollars, one wow. for spring and one for fall. That wasn't the goal. You know, the mm-hmm. goal was to just raise a thousand dollars to give to that person. So my bigger vision and go for Golden V Incorporated, put always get on, on scholarship for Team Union. Not only one kid, but a lot of uh, a lot of stu- uh, students in the Haitian community. Remember, you're getting bright futures. Mm-hmm. That's how I want Golden V to be. Can you let me just come up that all my goals are small, but Possibly new uh to support in the Haitian community, they make it bigger. Mm-hmm. So my my biggest goal is to be that resource for Haitian students. On luck going game, um, let me just say, come on, take on the um, take on on TV, only and on, sorry, but um, they didn't need to um, they're too passionate. They DM one, they because that okay. I have a 3.0 GPA. Um, or, I think it was like 3.7 actually. Um, but back at college, and I was like, "Who is that?" Only because I passed by your papier. I didn't know that was a thing, mind you. I am not a citizen. I am a um, green card holder, but mm-hmm. I've always been a legal green card holder. And by choice, I decided not to renew my citizenship. But 
not knowing as an immigrant, not knowing there's, there are immigrants in high school. Keep up. You have college, but you have five years. Yeah, you have high school. You have to, um, long, um, good grades in high school, but they can't go to college. And that thought of me, so I tried. Guys, my, my research, I'm Googling. I'm trying to find something for if I get in at wow. all. And you know why? The, um, a lot of the Haitian entrepreneurs, I like on um, Haitian business, your pocket scholarship pool, Timon, and the Haitian community. That's true. That's right? True. That's true. That's one of, that's one of, we have a lot of entrepreneurs in Grand Prix, we've got said business in America and Haiti, but there's no scholarship. There's a few organizations that provide scholarships. I want to say there's not more than 10. If it's, if it's 10, it's really hard to find. As this almost cap research for Team Munoz, that means they're not gonna find it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So my biggest goal is to inspire Haitian entrepreneurs and businesses who your who your Uve scholarship for Team Moon that doesn't have requirements for citizenship. That's that's big. That's big. So Ogoba is like, but jump us as have you know. We got to build business in community, you know. But like mm-hmm. it's very rare poor who's run on on mm-hmm. business keep provide a scholarship for you know young kids or specifically for young Haitians. It's liba facile, liba facile So yeah, that's pretty amazing. Yep. That's pretty amazing. I'm gonna hold you to that one. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna hold it. To, you know, everybody else, uh, the other SNSTs, your fellows. You'll get scholarship to two yeah. guys. Or, you know, you could be a citizen, not citizen, or whatever. But in this, I can to me take on for scholarship for team, um, Haitian students. Um, I know because we know our community, being a citizen wouldn't be a factor. Mm-hmm. You know? So, yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. So that's hopefully, true. I can inspire people. It's all about insp- inspiring and impacting that community to have them do that communicate with them partnership collaborations and things definitely definitely um definitely bon guys so kunya no pas fonti no pas transitionner no pas poser quelques questions qui et un sujet personnel they're not that personal but you pas by audience la i guess on ti idée de qui est souillé personally right so première question et qui pigo les sons va pendant la vous Biggest lesson, lesson, lesson mm, is um, 2000, I, 2017, <laughs> lesson one, because that's post-graduation, right? Mm-hmm. So post-graduation, um, you're, you're tackling life a lot, and it's not really working out or whatever. Yeah. My biggest lesson is to take your time. Don't rush. I have an issue with rushing ideas and rushing projects and putting things out. So mm-hmm. I, t- I, I, my biggest lesson is taking my time, appreciating life and living. Wow, that's that's pretty amazing. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. Go back out to learn. But see, number one, especially you know with social media and all that stuff. Yeah. Um, it's. You get you get pushy sometimes, right? You look over to buy so tea, you know, rapid. Yeah. So Yeah, think we're not rush. Everybody is trying to have a master's degree by twenty five, doing everything by twenty five. <laughs> um <laughs> That's you know, true. People be on business and things like that. And that's perfect, but everybody's rushing because it's a race. That's on Instagram and on social media, everybody's trying to do everything at once. Yeah, that, that's down. true. That's true. Yeah, and I think it, it puts a pressure on, on you too. It's put a burden, not even yeah. pressure, put a burden because you're exactly. like, oh, I got to get this by 25. And then mm-hmm. now you, you're 24, almost 25, you're freaking mm-hmm. out. Because... Not 30. <laughs> yeah, never mind. I'm going to do it at 30. So, what's the biggest impact on you? My mom. Yeah. Um, 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 feel impact in the life that she lived. Mom, she lived in frequently. I don't know how she did it. Like she no on housekeeping salary. I never needed anything. My college, mem, 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 see my college, um, college, um, pagayan, pagayan, pagayan. It left 
I became an adult in less time. Went, oh, wow. Um, I didn't mm-hmm. have a microwave or a mini fridge on my request. But my mom said to back at home when she inspires me. I will hope when I have kids and I become a mother and I'm going with my mom. We feel the young from Lago now, so we're going to imagine the goo and stuff like that. We feel good, free, deep, nice. We feel like, you know, leggy, booyah, you know, you're that living the best time. life. Yeah. My <laughs> family <laughs> always hold me down with the food, but she's my biggest impact. Um, She has a big impact in my life in the way I live and the way I see life. She gives good um, advice and things like that. So it's my mom. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty interesting. That's, that's amazing. Mm-hmm. Um, so, Ki Live Wap, not Ki Live Wap, you know, mom, but Ki, what's your favorite book? Favorite book of all time is Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Nice. Yeah, that's a, that's a classic right there. Yeah. That's a classic. That, I feel like you have to read that book every year because it changes your perspective on education and um, entrepreneurship and, you know, financial freedom. freedom. So I really mm. like it. Yeah. No, on book is very, very, very interesting. I, Marco, I just took my captain the podcast, or the captain the episode, so I put you all the leaves, rich dad, poor dad, but it'll change, like, love. It'll change how you see the world. Um, mm-hmm. So, yeah. so definitely check it out. Um, so when you're not doing anything related to Golden V, um, what do you do for fun? This sounds funny. I like to take pictures. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> pictures like of what? Pictures. Nature? <laughs> um, um, I like to take pictures of myself. Oh, yourself. Like nice. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And also, women, I'm into graphics and content creation and editing and stuff like that i'm because of covid 19 and quarantine to what i say it allowed me to tap into that because i've always been good at it but i never mm-hmm. tapped into because you know if i can't come from this you know i don't mean things like that so due to quarantine i tapped into it so i really really enjoyed it so that's what i'd like to do to create i like to create let me not say pictures people don't think i'm crazy like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So content like creator TV. content creator over here. yeah yeah right. basically i enjoy it boom bye guy boom bye guy and then um i need to say fini avec the viewer oh you see me this ah no fini la le va it's it's easier than you thought <laughs> yeah it is <laughs> <laughs> um So, pour moi qui intéressé avec Golden V ou bien comme moi qui intéressé pour jeune scholarship ou bien pour jeune formation et sous comment pour aller au collège ou bien moi qui t'a avlé euh ma connaissance sponsorisé comme son en content creator ou son brand ambassador tout c'est son monde t'a avlé contacto ou bien contacter Golden V euh dim qui côté n'a n'a y a jeune yo d'a jeune sur internet là OK so pour Instagram ou kal na Golden V Inc on Instagram, on Twitter, and on Facebook. Um, the website is www.goldenv.org. And in Suvle Richwan, you can reach me at bell underscore Anis on all social media platforms. Awesome, 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 Anit. Uh, once again, thank you. Thank you very much for coming on the platform and taking this time. I know you are a pretty busy person, so I truly, truly appreciate it. A um, message that's good to be here. It took us a while to be here, but thank you for having me. Never giving up on me. <laughs> yes, debut last year. Debut on for comments. It took a while to get here. Debut okay. last year. We scheduled it for six four. But it's alright. We we made it happen. <laughs> yeah, we made it happen. Thank you for having me. I really really love what you're doing. Let me up. Um, new new balance. Enjoy it. seeing your oh. using your podcast. Yes, well. thank, thank you, thank you very much. Um, thank you once again. And mes amis, pas oublier et podcast ça disponible tout côté et nous sur Apple Podcast, Spotify, nous sur YouTube and then pas oublier tout à sur Facebook, Instagram pour capable connecter avec tout ça n'a fait. Et c'était avec vos amis Paul Luther avec Anit. Uh, ciao ciao.